All right, right here we got the one and one Kings versus the one and one Clippers. Bob McAdoo has really been doing it all for the Clippers. You'd like to see Kawhi and Paul George step up. Um, but also, I mean, you know, this King squad, um, Nate Archibald, De'Aaron Fox, Oscar Robertson really got to do a better job. Of, uh, they're at their best when they're passing, all three of them. They really got to do a better job of not taking that good shot, making the extra pass, and taking the great shot. Uh, who wins here tonight? Home court advantage, tough matchup. I'm going to have to go with the Clippers. Welcome, everybody. Thanks for joining us for NBA action on 2K Sports. I think Bob McAdoo gets this here. Oh, no, he doesn't. This is Kevin Harlan. And joining us on the sidelines. I really, honestly, tough matchup. I should have said whoever gets a tip off. It's win. the Sacramento Kings and the Los like, Angeles I'm already thinking Clippers. about winning the team. Let's take a look at our starters for Sacramento. Win. We've got De'Aaron Fox. Lucas is out there with Robertson. And it's Archibald. De'Aaron Fox. Right, but no go. Oh, Blake Griffin has been playing out of his mind, too. Uh, last season. Oh, uh, mouse in the house. Nate Archibald. Uh oh They're going to do that. Lakers formula. Lakers picked up a win over the Kings by Bully. Nate Archibald with, with getting more mismatches with Shaq and also, I mean, having Magic go at him down low. Um, Shot clock at six. Fires from deep. Now the Ooh. scoring column with that bucket. One for two this game. Nate trying to fire back, though. To work trying to be bully proof here. Shot. When he's knocking it down from there, boy, the D is in trouble. There's the pick from the stripe. And it's George yes. missing. Not boy, the a best miss like that quality shot there. Any score crazy. Uh, Jerry Especially Lucas. with the defender giving a cushion. Taking him. There we go. Nate Archibald taking Blake Griffin all the way first out, way beyond the three. The, first quarter, the pass to Fox. Yes, me. I, I would have said everybody clear out to the right Pulls real up. quick. Another I was an eight calling that. I said, yo, everybody clear out. Look at the result <laughs> of that we, shot. We cook this man. Whenever they get it. And they should, because it's when you start uh, turning Now they got him again on down low. Try to get him to switch so and then bully him down low. And that is why his number gets Seems to be the time and time again. king's weakness. Outside Fox. If you can get him in foul trouble. Another miss by Fox. Fox has gotten just one of his four attempts from the floor tonight. And stolen by Lucas. Oh, great steal by Jerry. Let him be patient too. Not, not forcing anything. And I'm sick as a dog, first, man. Just under two and a half minutes played so far. And just able to score oh, wow. in so many ways. Kawhi. Had enough, just said, all right, fluff it, man. First trip to the free throw line for him in this one. Oscar, 24.5 points a game in the first two games. I mean, you know, let's we'll see if he can keep it up. But that is, uh, I mean, that's basically a pace to lead the league in scoring in this league. So it's the Clippers now. Yeah, that's some good odds, at least. Just over two and a half minutes played here so far. Oh, in the first oh Kawhi! Oh! Oh! Point 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 here for him. While he is deliberate, Kawhi Leonard reads the defense and knows when and Look at that pass out of the shot, done. and then it led to potentially a three-point play. Again, they're bullying Nate Archibald, getting him on any kind of switch they can. Throw good and yes, it is. Three-point play, and Nate's in trouble. The Kings trail by three. Here's Archibald. Sacramento moving it around. And here's Robertson. Mm. Oscar Robertson with the slam. Oscar, though, Making the realizes most he's got Kawhi upset. Frustrated. In the perfect spot, Greg. Freeze him up to get all oh, oh, the way to the Chris Paul kind of lost control there. The defense, no fighting through the paint. They're attacking no Nate hard. My goodness. To the paint. Oh, that's why you always want the offense. What a no. Through tiny. He's a dual threat with his passing and scoring, and he's always going to make the right decision, like on that assist. 
Let's it go from 11. Leonard, no Good defense and by the big O there. Close to the hoop. I thought he had enough room to finish that one. Now they're right back on him. Here's Archibald. Still looking for his first bucket in this one. He's and wide open. Outside. Oh, Good on the three point shot. Kawhi got and caught up on the world's Robinson most vicious screen. Free throw there by <laughs> Wayne Embry. Was it Kawhi? Or, or, oh, they had him switched on Blake. That's why. So, switched on Blake. That's why. so then no one came out beyond the arc. Oh, my goodness. And the pastor. Bob McAdoo. To the precise spot. It needed to be. seven points by himself. He's doing it all for the Clippers. He needs someone else to step up, man. He can't do it all all season, that's for sure. Robertson outside. Who's gonna step up? The three pointer, no good. Ideally you want it to be Kawhi. Play Griffin. Here's George. That one doesn't go. Great to know how George tends to be clutch. From our reporter, David Alder. Oh, wow, Jerry. Driving down low. Oh, George really has the ability to defend the four, though. This is the first meeting between these two teams. So that wasn't a gimme, Jerry. Jerry had to work for that. But he told me sometimes that's when we're at our best. Why? Oh, great pass. Great find. And by the way, great effort by Bob McAdoo. Kawhi should have easily went and put that up. It could have easily been a rubber play. play. But Bob McAdoo staying with it. That requires making plays for one another. Move the ball and shooting opportunities will present themselves. He finds himself open. Ooh. The shot by Robertson, no good. At this point, the Clippers, very lucky man. The big O couldn't make him pay these pass. Couple trips down the floor, getting wide open. Robertson Looks from beyond the arc. Can't tie it up as that one's no good. Robertson passes to Archibald. Now they're going to try to find a different formula. It's clearly not Oscar's night. Let's see Lucas. if we can get. Wants to get it to Aaron Robertson Fox and does. From outside, or maybe Oscar down low. Oh, it's hauled in by yeah. George. Boy, surprised he missed that. He's getting, getting a little cold, good man. To prevent that bucket. Paul, He's got him frustrated, but getting a little cold. And no good. Had a chance to take the lead there. The Kings leading. Get the ball to the left side wing. Out of his hands. Oh, De'Aaron Fox. Right oh, make the extra pass. Nate three. Archibald. Why? Why, Nate? Nate? He must have been too open. He thought it was suspicious that he was that open after they've been bullying him tonight. He doesn't take the shot until Paul George is well in position to defend it. Big O, though, leading the effort on defense. Here's Archibald. Despite not really being able to. This is what I like about him, too, really. Some people, when they can't make make a and shot, kind of fall apart and get out of the game. And then he's like, okay, I'm going to make it a difference everywhere else. I mean, getting rebounds and playing stingy defense. I mean, look at him. That's good defense right there. Fought over a screen, still had a pretty okay contest. Kawhi just happened to throw that in, but that, that was... So, I mean, he came out, I don't mind him taking that shot, really. Because they're, they're not going to prosper off of it. Alright, now we see a, a full swap. Mike Bibby, Eddie Jones, Lionel Simmons, Flores, and Cousins are the bigs for the Kings. And then you got World B3. Ooh. I believe you got Porter, you got uh, Chapman here, uh, Elton Brand, and then of course Lamar Odom. And stolen by Cousins uh, for the Clippers. Here's Flores. I believe Brand. that uh, gets the for the Clippers, Daryl Chapman is their with the triple. their rookie, and he's got a lot of promise. Porter looking at Porter. Had some potential last year. Never really fully realized it. So I think they, they went with uh, they went with Chapman for that reason. But nothing yet on the scoreboard for him. Simmons left side. Johnson wide open. Oh, 
the basket good off the assist from Simmons. And guys getting into a nice and, uh, groove here. And of course, in this universe, Lamar Odom. And this is part it's of not. what the game has become, On right? Drugs, a so. of dueling three-point opportunity. <laughs> you know, he's realized his full now potential. Ooh, oh, Porter. Hey, this is I was talking bad about him. He must have heard me. Trying to prove me wrong. JT Porter. Look at that. The Clippers have gone one for one. Previous attempt at the line. Porter at the line for one. On the free throw, no good. Slow house online. Your boy Till, if you haven't heard of him, he's somehow watching me. Check him out. Till House on YouTube. Back to Cousins. First shot, first pass. Mm. He's out of the blocks fast. We say it time and time again in the school. Good offense will be good defense every single night. That is why Cousins puts up the numbers he does. Free against Bibby. This is it to break. Here's free. Brand a screen on Bibby. Pass to Chapman. Oh, Chapman. And a Bam. In Los Angeles with a triple. Well, Busting an open pass He does give him a good outside. Opportunity. This Clippers doesn't have really much of an outside threat at all. Maybe with it. Daryl Chapman able to still scoreless potentially this one. Took him up with that. Sacramento moving it around from the arc. The basket mm. good off the assist from Simmons. Maybe he's got it all tied up now for the Kings. And how about the shooting stroke of Bibby? His three-point shot is as money as it gets. Two minutes remaining in the first. Hey there, Chapman. Ooh. Here's Chapman. Let him go to work the rookie. Five to shoot. The right side. And another three for the Clippers. This is as poor a shooter as there is. You've got to stay connected or it's a problem. Outside, Simmons. Here's oh, Cousins. Cousins. Score the basket. His second of two big. This definitely on helps Odom. your offense. You're not relegated to the perimeter with Cousins on the floor. You can create easy opportunities. Here's the pass mm, to Chapman. Chapman wide open. He clangs that one off the back iron. Showing you his potential. Showing you his promise tonight. Five points so far. Wow. One ten left in the first quarter. Here's Flores. Top target with his three. Los Angeles leading by three. Chapman the pass to free. Oh, oh. Oh, and then oh. no question. Put it down. Put it up. Wow, and that sort of showmanship is just deflating right now to a team trying mm. to get back into a game like this. Ouch, Greg, that is definitely an They got a two for one here to Kings do. Apostrophe or exclamation point, maybe even a question mark. Here's Simmons after the basket. Oh, Eddie Johnson, that's a bucket. Sinks the triple. Johnson's got his They acted fast, bucket. too, so. He must play better defense than that. Play good defense here. They got an easy chance to. Really, they got a chance to go into the second quarter with the lead. Shoots. Oh, but that's <laughs> Chapman's bread and butter right there. He's been absolutely on fire. Open team in and just getting it to him in rhythm. Three seconds separate the shot clock and game. Oh, yeah, they can still. Oh. So now they got a chance to actually draw up a play here. Nineteen seconds left in the first. Bibby kicks to Cousins. That's cool. Oh, I like that. that time. He has seven. You can run just about any action for Demarcus Cousins and feel good about your chances to score it. I like that a lot. Johnson outside. Last shot. And Ooh. Last shot. All right, so they're only down one, actually. Uh, they want to tip off. I'd like to say that they'd be able to to come back and win, but ah, uh, tough matchup. I'm gonna go with the Kings. I'm gonna go against because I've been wrong the past like two games, three games. I'm gonna go against what I want to say, and I'm gonna say the Kings. Ah, uh, I can't win, man. I can't win, man. Uh, 
a 16 point margin of victory for the Clippers, uh, really just, uh, it, you know, it comes down to, to shot percentages. The defense, I mean, you hold somebody to 114 points, you know, the defense outrageous, but look at the, really the rebounds, the assists, the bench was a huge, huge part of their success here tonight. Um, down two at half, down another five. Uh, so down seven going into the fourth and managed to just will shots in perfect seven to seven from the line. Um, five of 10 from beyond the arc. Uh, the fourth quarter is what won them this game a phenomenal fourth quarter performance there. I mean, you look at their total game, you know, they they were their fourth quarter numbers were were the best thing they'd had all night. Oh, yeah, say, look, no elite scoring from anyone here on the Kings. Wayne Ember, yeah, with eight rebounds. Um, Marcus Cousins with, with three steals. But other than that, there's really nothing to write home about. Where are your, where are your three guys, right? De'Aaron Fox had nine points. Nate Archibald had eight points. And Oscar Robertson had 11 points on the night. You just can't do that. And it's really not even his. It's really De'Aaron Fox, three of 12. Three of 12, my guy. Mike Bibby with a rare, rare bad performance at two of seven. And Andrew Ball, three of nine. I mean, you, these guys are supposed to be an efficient team. You can't have people going 20% from the field. Make the extra pass, my guy. Make the pass. You're more capable. Make it. Make the pass. Do it. Meanwhile, though, for the Clippers, Elton Brand stepped up with 23 points off the bench. Bob McAdoo with an amazing double-double, 15 rebounds on the night and had two blocks. Will be free with a double double off the bench with ten assists. So yeah, their their bench really stepped up and put it away because he still had guys like Kawhi going five of fifteen. You, know, you can't really have that happen. Whereas you had Daryl Chapman five of five, three of three. You know from from beyond the arc, and then Lamar Odom not missing a single shot either. You know you got multiple guys not missing a single shot from beyond the arc. You're probably in good hands. You're probably gonna win, and then you got. I mean, Chris Paul with eight assists. You got Griffith with seven rebounds or seven assists, eight rebounds from the power forward spot. Um, so, yeah, I mean, you got uh, but like Paul George, two of 12. Come on, man. He got carried this game. Everybody knows it. 